Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. I've got the GX8 here in my hands, the Panasonic GX8, which, by the way, I really like this camera. Um, almost becoming a tough call whether I go G85 or GX8. Um, tough call. Really like the GX8. I like the form factor. Kind of looks like a rangefinder. And what do I have on the front here? I've got the 50mm F12 AIS from Nikon. So uh, the manual focus. Uh, and as you know from me raving about it lately, the build quality on this, I just love it. And the buttery, buttery smooth focus. And the nice thing on this body, on the GX8, is the focus peaking, which you don't get on a Nikon DSLR, makes manual focus a dream. The beauty of the Nikon DSLRs, they do have a little rangefinder feature where, you know, you get the little dot in focus when you're, when you are in focus, letting you know that it's in focus when you're focusing. And then you've got, it's got the little arrows side to side. In other words, letting you know you're going one way or the other too far. So it's a, it's a good, it's a good aid. They call it, a, I think it's a range finder focusing aid or something like that. But it's not as accurate or necessarily as easy to use as focus peaking is on one of these. Obviously the drawback is, is that even on an APS-C body, you're getting less depth of field. You're getting a shallower depth of field with the F12. Once you put the F12 on here, you lose about I guess it'd be about two stops because you're on, um, as far as depth of field, light gathering ability is, is awesome on this. I got some photos to show you. I was playing around. Ella was sitting in the room with the lights off with a Christmas, little Christmas ornament thing glowing. And I took some shots using the F12 on the uh, Micro Four Thirds here. And it's just, it just tickles you how much light comes in at F12. Um, and it worked very well with the focus peaking. I've been really enjoying using this lens on the GX8 with focus peaking enabled. I'm going to be shooting on the G85 too. I just happen to be playing with this on the GX8 this weekend. So without further ado, I wanted to show you some photos. So that I just, just some walking around grab shots, some Christmas ornaments, some shots of the kids, some just some, some stuff I've just, you know, nothing. Um, none of these are super high quality, um, you know, museum portraits or anything. They're just some walk around the house and test shots I've grabbed. So have a look at them. Um, if you're interested in either the GX8 or the um, 50 mil F12 from Nikon, the AIS, or um, you're looking for a good adapter, Micro Four Thirds to, um, to Nikon, that's the Photosee adapter. I'll put links to all that below. You can check them out on Amazon, all the user reviews. Both these are very highly reviewed. Actually, all three of them are. Um, and uh, see what the best price is. Maybe you can get a good deal, especially with it being in the holiday season now and all. If you have any questions about any of this, let me know in the comments below. And um, here, have a look at these photos. Thanks for tuning in.